Hello guys, welcome and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is your girl, Kinesthetic with the Kinesthetics, and I am here with you guys today with moving vlog number five, Cinco. So if you guys are returning, thank you guys so much for clicking on yet again another video. If you guys are new, welcome. You found your way to an amazing place on Beyonce's internet, okay? In case you guys are new, my name is Kendra, aka Kinesthetic, and I recently located from the Bronx, New York, to Houston, Texas. I'm gonna take these off because they're giving the girls reflection. <laughs> and I just been sharing my process of becoming a homeowner, the challenges, the successes, decorated and everything. So if you guys are interested, then go ahead and keep on watching. Do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, hit that red subscribe button down below and join the family, okay? Give this video a big thumbs up, drop a comment down below, and without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So today is Friday, October 21st, and I just got ready because I'm about to head out to do some things. Okay, we're gonna do some things today. But in today's movement vlog, I really wanna focus on my office space because this is where the money's gonna be made. As I told you guys, this is where the money reside, where the money reside. Where the money reside, where the money reside, where the money reside. Where the money reside. And the money can't be residing here if it looks like this. Okay. So we're gonna get this room together, hopefully, in today's video. So I already, let me show you guys. So I already built my desk. This desk is coming from Amazon. It's from the brand Nathan James. And it took me a while to get this together, okay? I'm not gonna lie, this desk was difficult to get together. So I still don't even have the drawers in. I still have to build one drawer. I believe one of the pieces are wrong, but I just be telling myself like, girl, I'm worried about it tomorrow. I'm worried about it tomorrow. And then tomorrow I'll come and then I'm gonna worry about it tomorrow once again. And then this drawer here, um, it can't push all the way in. So I have to fix that. So I'm gonna hopefully get that together. And then once the desk is assembled, I'm gonna go ahead and put my iMac on the desk and that's where it's going to stay. This little globe I got from Marshalls or TJ Maxx back home. I took this from my room at home. So I just feel like it's very, you know, fitting for the office space setting. So I took that with me. And then this lamp was purchased from my Amazon registry from my girl Lynette. This is just like an industrial black lamp. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna leave it over here. But at first I wanted to put my desk up against the wall, but I just figured that I wanna make it like be the center of the room and then put everything else around it. So that's what we're gonna do. Over here, I might put like a little bench or like a love seat just so that I can sit here to like record videos and then I can also sit here to record videos. So I'm gonna see what I can find in the shops today. So I'm looking for a chair for my desk. I don't know what color, don't know what vibe I'm looking for. I just want a comfortable chair with armrests that I can use at my desk. And then over here, I wanna look to see if I can find like a love seat, so. So I'm going to head to Baybrook Mall here in Houston, Texas. I like that mall. They have a lot of stores over there, so I wanna check out um, Home Goods. There's a Goodwill over there. So I wanna check out the stores and see what they have. But um, yeah, let's go. And I took my braids out, so you guys are probably watching these movie vlogs like, girl, are you okay? Yes, my hair. Yes, my hair. Look what I found, the Pottery Barn outlet. Let's see what they have. Yeah, everything in here is 50% off. So this is 50% off of this. 50% off this price. They have mad couches. Yeah, look how much stuff they have. Like literally so much stuff. I don't know what I need, but I need a damn um, chair for my desk. Mirror. My freaking camera just fell lens down. So let us pray that everything is okay because the last thing I have money for right now is another camera. This is more of like a dining chair. Mm -hmm. Eleven hundred. Place you like that. Mad bar stool. This dining chair is so cute. And they have two of them. So it'll be 150 each. Mm -hmm. 
Like what? Two ninety nine, and then fifty percent off. For what? It's a huge bug. I don't even know how to get out of here. <laughs> and my bag is on the other side. That's why my mother told me to never leave my bag. Oh no. Uh uh. Uh uh. Let us exit. But that shit starts flying. I almost died. But I'm leaving because I don't need any bugs in my house. That bug was so huge. I didn't know if it had wings. I was not trying to find out. So I left. So I'm gonna go to Ross and then Home Goods and see what they have. And then I'm gonna go to the Goodwill and the Walmart. But I'm just upset that I had to experience that because I thought I found a gem. 50% off of Pottery Barn and they have a I kind of like this to put in the office space along the wall. Mm -hmm. Origin set. <laughs> okay, so I just pulled up to Walmart, but when I was parking, I saw this store over here. It's called Ali's. It says good stuff for cheap. So I'm gonna just walk in and see what they have. Like, is it giving Dollar General? Is it giving Dollar Tree? Is it giving I need to be here? Is it giving you have anything for me? Okay, so they have food stuff in here. Coconut flour, $1.99. I never tried coconut flour before. Comment and let me know if you guys have tried, but I have not. Walnuts. I wanted to try Brazilian nuts. I saw Cynthia post about that. Seasonings. Damn, I should've came here for my seasonings. 99 cents. More food, beans. Cutlery. Garbage bags, the block bags. Christmas decor. They got the Big John Sue ornaments. They have vacuums. Bissell, Big Bissell, the pet eraser. Tiles. Okay. Rugs. Nothing is really piquing my interest. Do they have office shares since they have everything else? They have these for $3.99. Plugins $3.99. I just don't get where y'all getting this stuff from to mark it down. Bro, not method. It's giving us somebody went right next door to, to Walmart and took these things and marked it down. Like, I'm just so surprised. I've never been in this store before, by the way, guys. What else they have? My mother's gonna love this store right here. iPods, $10. I'm coming here when it's time for me to re up. They have these. $3.49. Okay, all these. Dishwash and soap. Small spaces, $1.99. $13.99. I think this is the size of the pods I have. Softener. If they have Dawn, Dawn, what's the one that I use? They have Dawn Ultra. Oh, it's over. Dawn, four times power, $3.99. $3.99 for the big John. $3.99. This is my new little spot for my essentials. This one don't respect me one bit. Like, I couldn't get one good picture of my hair today.
Hey guys. Uh, what is it, days later? <laughs> but I'm back on the kids' camp. <sighs> yeah, I am so tired. Oh my God, I'm exhausted. But I am working on my house. I just got home, it's Sunday, October 30th, and I'm gonna do some things around the house. So I was like, let me turn the camera on. I have on some acne cream. Can y'all even see it? Yeah, I have on some acne cream because it's not even that. But I wanted to show you guys some Amazon goodies. So I ordered some items from Amazon and I also have a gift from one of my internet friends. So let's go ahead and get into it. So I found these lights. If you guys watch, it was a moving vlog number two. I tried to put those press on lights in my closet and they fell down in a matter of time. So I found these on Amazon. So these are like motion censored battery charging lights that I could put in my closet. And also it's like a strip so you can put them under your sink as well. The reel that I saw, um, the girl put it like under her sink. So you know when you get up in the middle of the night to use the bathroom, you have a little bit of light and you don't have to worry about flicking the switch on. And they also, let me open one of them. We can see it, but they, they charge it like um, a battery pack. So they're rechargeable. So you don't have to keep, you know, putting in double A AA or triple A batteries. So let's see what it's hitting for because, and now that I have my drill, I could like put a nail in the wall to hang it up. But let's see. I'm determined to have some light in my closets. If I get caught cheating, that don't mean I don't love you. Like when the vision said that, I'm like, girl, what? Like I was messing with you until you said that. If I get caught cheating, that don't mean that I don't love you. So what that mean? What that mean? What do it mean, division? The girls need to know. And I'm the girl. That's my boo. Until he said that, and I'm like. So, this is Z Lights. Ooh, it's magnetic too. Okay. <laughs> and these were 50% off on Amazon. They might still be, I'll have them linked down below. But this is the light, so you guys can see it's just like a strip. And let's see what else is in here. We have this 3M magnetic. Oh, hold on now. Hold on now. Okay, so this side of the strip goes onto the wall like the 3M side. And then the other side. Oh. <laughs> okay. All right now. Okay, so let's hope this sticks to the wall. And Gabby gave me a trick on that video. She said to wipe the surface before you put it on with the other sticky light. So I'm going to try that tip with this. With these lights. And then this is the rechargeable power pack I don't know if it's charged already but this is how it looks it's real small and it does charge with the it charges with like the injury charger if y'all know that y'all know what the injury charger is okay so this is the battery pack and it just oh. <laughs> I was not expecting that okay so you put it here and then let me see is it on different modes I want it to get brighter I don't know, let's try to put this in a closet. Ah, I'm so excited. Okay, let me let it go off first and then I'm gonna show y'all. Okay, so I put the light up in the closet. Let me show y'all. Ah, it's motion censored. Okay, I love, 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 love. So I did wipe the wall with alcohol before I hung it up. Just a little tip, um, Gabby left that comment on my previous video and I was like, let me listen to my girl. So I have one here and I, I need to put one on the side too. So I actually need to order some more, but just an update. This is what it's looking like. I don't know if like what this button supposed to do. I don't even think it's a button. I wanted to show you guys real quick some additions that I got for my office space, which I'm really excited about. I have some other things coming in the mail. So we should have everything kind of together by Tuesday. That is my hope, but yeah, we'll see. First edition is this rug. So I purchased this rug from Ross and it was $45. It's not gonna stay here. I just have it rolled out because I wanted to see how it looked in this space. 
but I absolutely didn't put this light on so we could really see. But I love how this rug looks in the space. So it's kind of be like centered with the desk on top of it. But I feel like it gives a great introduction to color in my home and in my office space. Because my office, I want it to be fun. I want it to be fresh. My office space is somewhere that I plan to update frequently or more frequently than the rest of my house. So the fact that this rug was only $45, I was like, okay, bet. So I plan on having it in here. This is like a fall winter situation. And then when the spring comes around, I'll go ahead and revamp my office. I'm going to spend a lot of time in here. So I know myself, I know I'm going to get, I don't want to say tired of the decor, but I'm going to want change. And I'm just being honest with myself. So I felt like this rug was like a good starter piece. And then I'm going to order a chair that complements it. So I either want like a burnt orange office chair, or I want like a navy blue or some type of pop of color for my first office chair. So I got this rug from Ross, it was $45, it's five by seven. So I ordered a rug pad to put underneath it because if you don't have a rug pad, girl, this is what happened, okay? You're gonna be slipping and sliding. And it's not giving that because there was but so much insurance in this house. So yeah, I got that. This lamp you guys saw from before, um, this lamp is from Amazon, I'll have it linked down below. Yeah, and then, my light I need to change because it's giving yellow light and I don't like that. I feel like it makes my head hurt, so I'm gonna change that. I got a mipper, I got a mipper, I got a, I got a, I got a mipper. I got this from Home Goods yesterday. And just for reference, this is the code and it was $130 and it is from the brand Max Studio Home. So it's my little note they put on it to hold it. <laughs> But this mirror is so fun. I love the shape of it. It's really basic and I put it here because I'm gonna be sitting here to work. So if I ever have to, you know, turn around and look at myself and just remind myself that I'm that girl, I could go ahead and do that. So this is here. This desk is gonna be kind of here, like centered in the room. And then I'm gonna go ahead, I don't know if I'm gonna leave the lamp over here or bring it closer. And then I'm going to get a bench to put here so that I could sit down and record my videos. So that is basically the, um, I don't want to say basic, but the main items that are going to go into this room. I was thinking of getting a bookshelf to put like centered on this wall, but I'm going to see after I have everything else in to see if it looks like too cluttered or whatever the case is. But this is what the office space is looking like right now. So also from Amazon, I got a package from one of my internet friends. Oh my god, you guys know I love this packaging. Thank you, girl, for putting in the extra effort. And the card is right here. Oh, Katrina. My girl Katrina. She sent me a cute little gift. Oh. Y'all just y'all just be blowing me away, okay? Like the way y'all mess with me, it's okay because I mess with y'all too. Period. So I'm gonna open this um. Oh, it is the pot holder that I had on my registry so that I could organize the cabinet where I have my pots. I'm so excited about this. Okay. And it's right on time because I was about to get this kitchen together. Well, this gift has honestly been sitting by my door for so long, but I went away, I was here, I was there, and I finally got around to opening it. So thank you so much, girl. I love you so much. Thank you for rocking with your girl. Cause you never rock with me for a minute, okay? She been watching my videos for years and years on years now. So thank you for your continuous support. Thank you for this gift. Thank you for blessing my home. If you guys are interested in sending Casa Kinesthetic a housewarming gift, I have the link down below for my Amazon and Target registry. But just to show you guys, I don't know if I have to assemble it. Maybe I should keep the instructions. Today is Sunday and I really just want to start the week off, especially since the month is starting on Tuesday, with like a clean space so I can have a clean mindset. So that's really what I'm doing today. I just want everything to look decent, to be decent, to feel decent, so that you know, I can be in the best place, okay? So the one thing about me is I'm gonna figure things out before I read the instructions. I don't like reading instructions. I don't know if it's just me, but I just be like, all right, bet. <laughs> one plus one equals two, baby. Okay, so you can go ahead and like put your pans in here and organize it nicely. So thank you, girl.
are so pretty. So I think my vision for Christmas is like white and silver. But I'm not trying to spin a bag, but I'm also not trying to look cheap. Sounds in my head. You gotta be careful in stores like this because things could start looking cheap real motherfucking quick. I'm in at home and I'm actually seeing a lot of things. Maybe because I have more of a sense of direction of, you know, what I want right now. I'll show you guys things that I found. And I also found these placemats. I don't know how I feel about these. Because they match like the natural wood of my bar stool. So these would be like if you're eating on my counter. The amazing thing about home decor shopping is you can always return it. <laughs> so I got three of those, one for each bar stool. Then they also have these, which is a square. Well, that's I don't know which one I like better. Oh, I saw this table that I could put by my entryway. Backyard chairs, an office chair. Yeah. I saw this a kid for her approval because y'all know my sis be helping your girl out. One of the main reasons I came here is to get like some type of organization for my receipts and papers. I see this and has a lid. So I think I'm gonna get this. I wish I had two. Federal. So I'm and I kind of wanted containers to put my hair products in. They have a lid. The ones I had before didn't have a lid and I didn't like that because I wasn't able to stack them. So I'm gonna see if I can find something in here. So I found these lanterns. I kind of want to do my backyard like black and cream. I'm gonna get this off. She had two. So I'm gonna do uno. Seems to be a trend. These are Chanel candles to put in the back to keep the bugs away. I found this cushion. I'm gonna put it on the chair to see how it looks. Okay, so these are the chairs I decided on for my outdoor patio in the back. And they're originally 180, but it says here that they're 150, so basically $300 for two chairs. Love that. Well, I came out of at home and this is on my windshield. I don't even play those games with all of these sex stories. Y'all ain't gonna get me. Y'all ain't gonna get me. Y'all ain't gonna get me. Hey guys, so I'm home. I'll show you guys everything that I picked up probably tomorrow because I'm just trying to get some things done so I could go to sleep so that I can wake up and be ready for work tomorrow so right now i'm just blue taping so that i can place some orders online so you guys see i'm blue taping for a tv i'm so excited but i'm trying to see what size i want slash need target's having some black friday early deals right now and they're actually good prices so if they're still available by the time this video goes up i'll have the information down below but if not, I'm pretty sure they'll have the same deals or even better for Black Friday. So just make sure you have your coins prepared. But since I am hosting um, people starting on a Wednesday, I figured it would be right to, you know, at least have one TV. So guys, I decided that I'm going to put a TV in my room. I know, I know, I know, <laughs> I know. But I just, I just, that's the truth. I just, so let me go ahead and move the tape. This, so this is 65 inches if I do a 65 inch TV. I'm also going to measure for the console that I'm going to get to see the height. Okay, it says it has a height of 22 inches. I love it up here. 
because when I sit like on the couch, whenever I figure that out, yeah. And then I still have room to like put stuff on top of the console. And then the one that I want to get for my room is 43. So let me. It's the next day and I'm about to get my life in order or try to. <laughs> So I'm in my office right now and I am about to put the rug pad down so that I can actually place everything where it needs to be. I also ordered an office chair but it says it won't be here until November 19th. So yeah, I'll put a picture of it on the screen though so you guys can see what it's going to look like. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take everything out. I need to wipe my mirror down. I want to be able to put my iMac up hopefully so let's make some things move and make some things shake i have all these items here which are going to be included in clothing hauls y'all can't look y'all can't look yet y'all can't look yet wait i'm gonna put this though <laughs> please oh i'm back so this is the rug pad that i got i got this from amazon this is the same rug pad that I got for my bedroom, but just a different size because this rug is five by seven. So, ooh, what does it smell? So Bob the Builder is back, okay? So I didn't show you guys me assembling the desk because honestly it was a shit show, I'm not even gonna lie. This was harder to assemble than my bed and for some reason in my head I thought it would have been easier since it was less pieces. Don't mind my missing press on nails, they gonna go back on. But I just thought it would have been easier and it was not. So I was just struggling. It took me about two weeks to get here. We're still not done. I still have to build the other drawer. So certain things, like when I'm doing it, I'm like, okay, I need to get my eyes off of this and then recalibrate my brain and then we can revisit it. So I guess I'm at that point now because I low-key just want to be done. And I don't want to put my desktop up yet because it may require that I take the desktop down to fix like foundations of the desk. So that's where we are right now. Um, let me see what this thing is saying because babes, I can't be bothered. Okay, time to assemble the snack drawer. I mean drawer, secure. They wanna be telling jokes. Focus on what I gotta do. Let me know what I gotta do. Um, okay, so. bug on my desk. Ah! Breathe, relax. <laughs> Patience is an important virtue, it is. So I'm on the phone with Amazon right now, trying to see what they could do. Cause literally, 
I can't build one of the drawers. The piece in the back is missing and that was what was effing me up this whole time. Okay guys, so update. My memory card was full so I had to go ahead and clear it off so I can give you guys more content. So I decided that today's gonna be the last day of moving vlog number five. So whatever I do today for the house will be the last day of this vlog and then we're gonna move on because baby, when I tell y'all that I was having high expectations of what would have been in this vlog and it's just didn't happen so it is what it is and it ain't what it ain't so the desk is a bus and it's crazy because as i was building it i'm like damn do i really like this do i really like this do i really like this and i realized that i don't love it i don't love it so i contacted amazon and they basically told me that they're gonna have a company come up come out and pick up the desk and they take it as it is like 75 percent assemble and they give me a refund so i'm gonna wait for them to come get this desk and i'm thinking if in the meantime i should go ahead and pick up another desk because it was a desk i saw at home and i liked it so i figured out the problem with this desk is that i think the wood is too dark for my life my liking i would have preferred like more of an oak color wood versus like this medium brown colored wood so I'm just happy that I realized it now versus when I struggled to get this desk to 100% and then I'm like, it's a no for me. So I'm gonna go ahead and probably pick up that desk when I go back to um, at home. The placemats that I found yesterday, I don't really love them. So I'm gonna bring them back. So when I go return the placemats, I'm gonna get the desk. So that is update, I guess, number one of part one. And I ordered a chair. It's not coming until November 19th, I think. So I think I told y'all that already. And I also wanted to show you guys some updates. So just some home updates. I finally got a trash bin and I got a simple human, Ooh, period. Talk to me nice. Simple human, 45 milliliter. This is a semicircle situation. They had like a rectangle one too, but that one was more expensive. So I said, mm-mm semi-circle okay so i got that yesterday okay so for the patio i have two cushion options i'll pop pictures on the screen after i discuss like you know the whole spiel with y'all it's a little chilly i keep my crocs out here and there's always bugs in them and i don't mind my lesson but i refuse to bring it inside because there's bugs in them <laughs> but here is the patio area these are the two chairs that I picked up from at home and the lanterns I got from Home Goods. I don't think I showed them to you guys when I got them. But I'm having a little dilemma right now because I'm just like, hmm, do I love this? I like the chairs. So the chairs, both of them were $300, which I don't think was bad because a lot of chairs that I was finding was like $300 for one. So that's number one. Number two is I'm not sure if I want to keep these lanterns with the chair or if I want to get the, I'll put a picture on the screen, the lanterns that have the little clear door. I don't know if I would prefer that better. And then also, I found another set that ended up being like $250 and it comes with the table. So I'll put a picture of that on the screen too. But the only problem with that set is that I feel like the chairs are more like structured. Like you have to sit up straight. So I don't know what I should do about that. But in general, I do want to get a rug, put a rug out here and have like a little table because the I guess vibe of this area is that if you want to smoke you come out here to smoke you're not going to smoke in my house so that's the purpose of this area so I'm going to go ahead and get a rug I'm going to look online for a rug and then lighting I either want to put like light bulbs around or I want to go ahead and get lanterns and hang it from the ceiling so this is my little patio update you guys can let me know your thoughts down below on the options that I just showed you guys and then on these chairs I'm definitely gonna put cushions so I will show you guys the options of the cushions here um, either like more of a tan color or a gray color I found these at home goods but um, yeah this is the little patio area right now so now I'm about to head to Target real quick to pick up an item. I don't know if I told you guys, but I ordered the TVs last night. So I ended up getting a 65 inch TV for my living room and I got a, I think 43 inch TV for my bedroom. So that's what we came out with. The 65 inch, I had to go pick it up in the store. So I have to drive to a Target, which I'm gonna do right now before I get busy, like, you know, preparing for my cousin's arrival and the 
43 inch one for my bedroom which is gonna go here it's gonna be delivered because they didn't have it available for pickup and also i don't know if my car is big enough to fit a 65 inch tv but we're gonna find out today okay so i'm gonna head over to target and oh i'm walking to close this blind and it wasn't even open but i'm about to head to target so i'll see you guys in the car <laughs> Trying to see if I can find a TV mount. I have one, but I need another one. Hey babe, so these prices, I'm gonna be right back on Amazon because what? I don't care if it twerks, swivels, spins. Mm -mm. And I also want to get a sound bar for my little room. So that's something I'm gonna, ooh, now we're gonna sell for $100. But I kind of want to sim someone if they have. I got a, oh, this one. This is the one I was looking at. This is so cute. At Target, Project 62. But this is like the color wood that I was talking about. Now I'm seeing it everywhere. So. I kind of like this one better than the one at home. Let me see the price. And this one is cheaper, period. Look at God. He knew exactly what he was doing, as he always do. And it says it has a charging station. What is that? Okay, so I just pulled up to Target drive up so that they could bring the TV to my car. But y'all, I don't know what it is. But my bowels have been moving, okay? When I say moving, I mean moving. Like, every time I come out the house, it's like my body just busts a move. I don't get it, but... I say all of that to say that I'm gonna have to clench my booty cheeks as I head home because I'm not trying to be in anyone's public right. Tell me why as soon as I get home, I don't have to go anymore. The whole drive home, I was clenching my booty cheeks, okay? But the goods are secured. We got a little wet up, but I got the TV. It fit in my car, but literally exact, so. I'm gonna take this out tomorrow because I have to open the um, the garage door to get it. But, and I'm not doing that when it's dark. I do not need frogs leaping in here. Y'all know the rules, no frogs allowed. But this is the TV, it's 65 inches. I'll show you guys how it looks in next week's vlog because it should be mounted by then. But yes, I got my first TV. <laughs> so that is it for this moving vlog number five, Cinco. It's been a minute. But don't worry because moving vlog number six will be uploaded shortly after this one. Since things are moving, I'm going to order that desk I showed you guys in Target. So hopefully that desk could do what I'm expecting a desk to do. So stay tuned and you guys will see. If you guys made it all the way until the end of this video, thank you guys so much. My phone is so big, you can't even like fit in the frame no more. Okay, that's what I'm talking about, honey. But if you guys made it all the way until the end, thank you guys so much. Make sure you guys comment down below with a... Make sure you comment down below with an emoji that has the color black in it. Not my broken nail. But make sure you guys comment with an emoji that has black so I know my girls and my boys who made it all the way until the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, make sure you guys subscribe to my YouTube channel. Give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below and answer any of the questions posed in today's video. So advice on the patio, advice on my office space, advice on anything that I said in this video because it's, it's been a minute. So I know that this video is probably going to be kind of long. But comment down below. Let me know what your favorite part of this video was. And that is it. I will see you guys in my next video. I'm about to edit this right now so I can put it up tomorrow. And then I have another video for you guys on Friday. And then a vlog on Sunday. So make sure you guys have your bell notifications on so you don't miss a beat. And that is it. I'll see you guys later. Love you guys so, so much. Say what I wanna hear, cause you know it's gonna get me here. Every time I say that I'm